Welcome back to Good Day. You know, coupons are a great way to spend less at the grocery store. Whether you say coupons or coupons, it doesn't matter. They're awesome. But they take a lot of time. They, they, they can slow down the line. You got to cut them out. You got to organize them. Well, Jenny Sanford is here to tell us how to save your money without clipping coupons. There are other ways we can do that. So how do we do this? Because, you know, clipping coupons is great, but it takes a whole lot of time. Right. So it all starts with where you're shopping. And Which I'm not, store specifically? I know, I'm not going to tell you where to shop because it's going to depend on what you're buying for <laughs> your family. What so what I suggest doing is taking a list of the 10 items that you're buying most frequently okay. and actually checking the different stores. And I know that sounds like a lot of work, but think about if you were buying a big screen TV. You'd probably shop around. Sure. Now think about you're spending hundreds of dollars usually per month or even per week sometimes for family. So that money adds up. So that time that you spend to do something like that can really pay off. So take the 10 most common items, shop, do that once just to get an idea of where yeah. those items are typically yeah. cheaper. Yeah, go around to a couple of your local stores and and Because you're always going to be buying checking. those. The exactly. cereal, the bread, yes. the milk, what yep. have you. Interesting. Exactly. Okay, so what else can we do? So the other thing that you're going to want to do is find substitutions for expensive items. We all know that red meat has gone up significantly yeah. in the past six months. So Maybe instead of ground beef tacos, make ground chicken tacos or chicken ground tacos. Ground turkey is cheaper. Exactly. Yes, it is. It is. Yep, exactly. So find those substitutions for expensive items. Look at generics. Um, you know, a lot of people don't like generics. You know, sometimes people do. That try them out. You're never going to yeah. know if you don't try it. I feel like you have to try them. We've tried some and they're bad and right. others and you can't tell the difference. So right. it kind of depends on, on, on what you're looking at. Yep. Okay, so now I'm in the grocery store. What can I do once I'm in the grocery so store? look up and look down. Like to the yes. top of the shelf? Those premium <laughs> brands are always going to be right in front of your eyes because oh. that's what people are reaching for first, right? So look up and look down. You're probably going to find some off brands, maybe some new brands, clearance items. Yeah. So look around a little bit. Like the guy in the old commercial shopping for the multi-meal multi -meal cereal where he's like, you yeah, remember that? Yeah. He's crouching because it, it's all on the bottom. It's yes. on, the, on the bottom shelf. They yes. want to hide it from you. And then when I see something on sale, I, I always have an urge to do this. It'll be, you know, five for 10 bucks. Should I buy five? Should I buy 10? No. So that's usually just a marketing gimmick okay. and you don't have to buy five or 10. So if you do see something on sale that you buy frequently, don't look at that as just a one-time opportunity to grab it. Stock up. Okay. Uh, so a lot of stuff we buy are, is shelf stuff. Stable, so you can stock up in, in that way. And I'm not saying stock up by 400 boxes of toothpaste <laughs> now, um, but you know, maybe get four or five if it's a really good price. Right. So stock up on that. So many items can go in your freezer too. Yeah. So, you know, fresh produce, even dairy items. I freeze all my shredded cheese. Yeah. So every time there's a really great shredded cheese sale, I stock up and stick it in the freezer. Some people freeze milk. Yeah. And can you can do that. So, milk. well, yeah. great ideas. Thank you so much. I mean, we're always looking for ways to save money. You can find more money advice in our Good Day section over at kdvr.com. And uh, that's the start. We're going to start there. Jen, Brooke, I'm, I'm, I'm saving. This is the month of saving. How's well, that there work? you go. And, and <laughs> you're you know, over here thinking about spending. So I was like, over my hmm, Twitter I kind of like that one.